Welcome back to Triple R, Random Work Reviews. So today we're going to do a action figure versus action figure versus action figure. Which one of these elites are the best uh, looking action figure? Not the best wrestler, uh, but they're both up to debate. Comment below which one you think is the best. So we will start off with who's currently wrestling at this time. Bailey, who is the champion right now. She just won at this WrestleMania. WrestleMania 40. But this is... Heel Bailey early on when she turned heel during the Thunderdome era. And she was also champion for over a year. Got her stats back here. So I've shown this character before on the channel. So we're just going to take a look at it. Comes with a Bailey buddy that she destroys, her weapon. So this is more about likeness on each one, how good they look as far as like compared to their in real life counterpart. So here's Bailey's picture. Face mold. Did a good job. Got the gear all correct. Got the neck art, the Bailey art. Got the splashes on there. Silver black. So this is a really good looking axe figure. I mean, all elites usually are. So that's the Bailey. Then recently, who came back to WWE? So Naomi. This Naomi Elite's probably around the same time frame, maybe a year, two years before she left for a while. Stats back here. Has been SmackDown's Women's Champion two times. Let's see how many. Uh, no. Gave her finisher though Arm Trap Headlock Driver, which she turned into the Rose Plant. Well, a lot of career highlights, Grand Slam champion, uh, but we're looking at how the action figure looks in comparison to their real life counterpart. So here's Naomi's picture. Man, they did a good job. They did a really good job on this one. So that's why these elites are probably going to stay in box. I like the way they look on the box. In the box, I should say. Uh, as our entrance gear there, I don't know if we can see. No, that's her. One of her moves. So she does she did come out with like one of these robes that glow. That's the championship belt. This is nice. It's a nice added feature. Gear's cool. Got the green. Green and black. Got the green on the hair. Green on the hair here. Of course she changed this up, but at this time it was green. I think it might be I think it's blue now. Looks good. And then the last one who we haven't seen in a while is Alexa Bliss. There's a better picture. Five Feet of Fury. Also a, a Raw champion. So, first to win both Raw and SmackDown Women's Championships. Finish Moon Twisted Bliss, of course, off the top rope. Uh, this is a, a better looking Alexa Bliss. I guess they have a hard time with her features. Where she's kind of like real grinny. Like her grin is, all, I don't know, kind of like comic book Batman villain. I don't think it really, it kind of looks, I guess she has kind of pointy features, they're saying. But I don't think this <laughs> really looks... I don't know. Well, something's off. So this isn't the worst one. I think the worst one for her is the one where she's in the suit. Uh, the rest of this is okay, though. It's hard to see her gear because he rented this out. Um, you can see the pink and the black here. The pink and the black. So she kind of had like a Harley Quinn going thing at the time. It's always cool when you include the belt. So I've got the white strap with the red on there. Looks pretty good. So in my opinion, out of these elites, as far as action figures that looks the best, it's probably going to be Naomi. So my favorite wrestler out of these three, I like all these wrestlers, they're great in the ring. Um, <clears throat> Bailey's definitely probably my favorite wrestler all around as far as Mike and in the ring. Uh, but action figure wise, I think this one is probably number one. Bailey number two, and unfortunately, 
Alexa Bliss is number three, just because I don't like how her face is such a, yeah, see, kind of face. <laughs> Russ looks all right. You ever like super definition in her legs? Yeah, I, well, yeah, I guess he did. I don't know if they're all muscled up like that. I don't, <laughs> I don't think it, I mean, she's in shape, of course, the wrestlers, but yeah, this is definitely the worst of the three. And I think it might be the oldest. I'm not sure. It may be. I have to check on that. Let me see uh, which one's the oldest. If that has anything to do with it or not. So yeah, this is the oldest one. This is 2017 Elite. It's maybe why this color scheme is different. And both these are 2020 Elites. But, um, but it's not a bad looking X figure. You know, if you're like a blessed fan, I think it's fine. Comes with the belt. That's cool. Uh, the Bailey one is spot on. So this one is like spot on, like for action figure versus real life. Um, this one, I think, I think so. Did a really good job on the face sculpt. Has this cool green belt for her glow gimmick. So action figure wise, overall, I would say the Naomi one is one, Bailey two, and Alexa Bliss would come in at number three. Uh, if you agree. Uh, leave a comment. If you don't agree, leave a comment. Let me know which one you think was the best action figure. Or rank, rank them yourselves, one through three. As always, thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night, wherever you are. Smash that like button. Hit subscribe. I do appreciate it. Thanks. Mm -hmm.